Your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson. We got Wade in here with us, and this is Wade's very first chiropractic adjustment ever. Yes, sir. And the only real complaint that Wade had today was that he feels compressed. We're going to see if we can impress him <laughs> today with a decompression to take care of his compressive stress. He gets some lower back tightness and stuff every once in a while, occasional shoulder tightness as well, upper thoracic as well. But majority of his is the compressed feeling in your spine. You've been feeling that way how long? Yes, sir. Probably like, man, like two years. And you played football, high school, yes, right? Sir. Four years yes, football. Sir. All kinds of stuff. So we're going to adjust Wade today for the very first time ever in chiropractic. So yes, sir. we're going to welcome him to the world of chiropractic. Let's show him your posture first, Wade. I'm going to have you close your eyes and flex your head forward and backwards for me, please, sir. And then back to neutral. Okay, this is really important. Okay, you just lifted his chin up a bunch, dude, but look how his head's about two inches forward. Do you see that in the mirror? Wait, look. Yeah. See your yes, head sir. way forward. That's what your shoulders are rounding forward here. You see his hands are out in front of him as opposed to being at his sides with his shoulders squared off. So we're going to realign X, Y, Z on him and get his lined up properly. The pelvis is translated left a little bit of center. Got more room on the right side than he does the left side. Now we've already done his history exam, but I'm going to show you a couple highlights here. Face down again, Wade. Legs are even. That's a good start. Ooh, that tightens up a little bit. See, I got longer on that right side by half an inch. Even down here. Gets shorter on the right there. Okay, did that tighten up a little bit at the end there, too, Wade? Yes, sir. In your lower back and thighs? Yeah. You got a little bit of SI right there on the left. A little bit right there on the right, too. Mostly right down here on the L4 and L5 in the lower lumbar spine. You see that he's got a little kyphosis beginning in here. So he's getting an increased hump in here. Yeah. You don't want to be getting that old man hump for yeah, your old man. Already. <laughs> Tight ribs all over. Yep. You're going to love me, Wade. Upside down this way just a little bit. Tender right down the left, right down the right, right down the right. Ooh, that's tender in there too. Lock your right leg straight for me, please. Lift that whole right leg up. Does that tighten up in your lower back? Yes, sir. Okay, relax that guy. Do this side now. Same on this side or less on this side? Uh, I'm not sure about the side. Same? Yeah. So again, he does have subluxations down his sacroiliac joints in his pelvis, his lumbar spine, thoracic spine, and rib cage seems to be his worst issue. And he's got a few up here in his cervical spine too. He's lost that curve and his head's way forward. So I'm going to start off with his SI joint adjustments. A little deeper in person, huh, Wade? Yeah. There we go. Okay, keep breathing. That's it. Boy, oh boy. Crack Ace gonna love you, Wade. Sorry to do. <laughs> <laughs> Legs are even. See how they stayed even that time? Is that easier on your low back that time, Wade? Yes, sir. Mm, cool. Alright, you'll feel your head popping up on this next one. There. You got a heavy head, you must have a lot on your mind. <laughs> there we go. Okay, let's turn you on your back, please, sir. Now, Wade's a young man, and I commend him for coming in and doing his treatment proactively. That's the, really the best way to prevent spine problems is deal with them proactively. Yeah. Put both arms out, palms up. No, straight out, kind of like Jesus on the cross. Here you go. There you go. Can you can relax your hands right there and tell me. Lay your head back there and I won't give you a whiplash. Um, let go of this leg. There we go. You should have felt that from your knee all the way up to your lower back. Felt it. Same thing here, let go of this one. There we Ooh. go, super. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna sit you over your face that way. Set, I'm gonna sit up, face that way. There you go. All right. Ooh, there we go. Oh, I do. This one where you had labor oh. surgery, right? This one. 
let go. There you go. This one's not as bad, but you got a little hinky in this one here too. Okay, relax. There it is. Let's come on this table away. Oh, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> lay on this table on your back. Your butt right there. Head up this way. Head up this way a little bit, about two inches. There you go. Perfect. You know, let, let just relax. The table's going to lift them up. I'm going to pin both your pelvic bones in with these big old pins. All right. It's going to feel tight the way it should. Well, this must be a new patient, first time experience day. We've had about <laughs> 10 first timers today. Busy day. Yep, always. Lay head back. Okay, you want to keep your teeth together on this one, Wade. Don't bite your tongue, breathe through your nose. Won't you will your right ear? Oh, there it is. Oh. Yes, sir. You should have felt that go yeah. all the way down, did you? Yes, sir. That was good. Yes, it was. And look, you there, you're still kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-uh, let me do it. Good. See, it works better when I do it. There you go. Perfect. <laughs> See, that's a lot better than doing that to yourself. Yeah, that is. I'm going to try to my girlfriend when I get home. Oh, no. I'm going to start right home now. I'm still not done with you. I'm still going to shoot. Well, look at your posture already. Can okay, your shoulders squared off better? It's crazy. Heads back further. Really? <laughs> yeah. You stand up straight your arm right. I bet you don't feel as compressed right now. That's not. There we go. Yeah, I'll pull these guys here. And then we're going to do your homework right here. Don't keep those shoulders pulled back for me. Both sides. Flare your hands, palms forward. And back here. Both sides. Head straight back and then look back. <laughs> your atlas there there okay you can relax now when you bend your head forward and backwards again wait this should feel easier up there but you tell me it does feel easier so when you come in the office feeling <laughs> compressed how are you leaving the office decompressed there sure. you go <laughs> so if you're feeling compressed come to advanced chiropractic relief in houston texas and we'll decompress sure. your spine with this non-surgical manual spinal neural decompression adjustment on the y-axis which I lovingly nicknamed the ring dinger. So by the way, Lives up to it. since you've got your first ring dinger adjustment today, that makes you the newest oh, member of Team Ring Dinger. So welcome to the team. <laughs> right. yep. So what would you right. share with our crack addicts worldwide about your first chiropractic experience ever? I'll definitely say the decompression is something. That's something special for sure. That, yeah, felt it all the way yes, down. Yes, sir. All the way down to the belly button. Yeah. <laughs> On the back part of it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Anything else you'd like to share with our crackheads? What would you describe your very first ring dinner as like? Oh, intense, for sure. Yeah, it is it's intense. good. It's, I like it. Yeah. I'll be back. Stuff. Yeah. <laughs> this is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson, coming to you from Advanced Chiropractic Relief in Houston, Texas, from Wade. Yes, With sir. Wade, I should say. <laughs> we'll see y'all soon. Good